and we're back with fight number two that I'm going to cover. Uh, it's a featherweight bout between Conor McGregor, the Notorious, versus Dustin Poirier. Uh, Dustin Poirier has the most UFC wins under the featherweight banner, so he's something to not look out for. Also looks for the finish. Doesn't like to cruise to victories. Conor McGregor, also a killer. But go for the finish. He's considered the future of the flyweight division. I see it, but it's not a for sure thing. Uh, personally, McGregor is my favorite over Poirier because McGregor is just so fucking fast. Just realized I cursed in it though. But he is, he's fast and he is strong. He will always look for the kill. Technically sound, he's just a little raw is his only issue. As you can see, the height similar. The reach advantage actually goes a little towards McGregor. But Poirier definitely looks a bigger 145 than McGregor does. But uh, the Irishman certainly is a great fighter who also loves to wear three-piece suits. Mario Yamasaki with the heart. There's going to be no love here. There we go. Started out with where he's strong. Let's see if I can make uh, McGregor proud. He predicts first round TKO. I mean KO. By him, not uh, Poirier. Man, Poirier is smothering. Mm. Poirier is a very good striker. But one thing to look out for is the kicks that Gregor throws. There we go. Let's get up. I remember uh, Poirier definitely smothering me on the ground. Ooh, I thought that was... Oh, God. Oh shit, he caught the kick. Absolutely a phenomenal fight. delivered on McGregor's promise and that's my prediction Conor McGregor wins by first round knockout uh, although I don't think it'll be this glitchy absolutely monstrous wait what just happened to his leg oh okay uh, well he's at least a little not so limp I guess uh but yeah, that's my prediction. The Notorious McGregor takes out Dustin the Diamond Poirier. First round knockout. 